Welcome back Paradigm Kids. I am so excited to share today's lesson with you. Let's go! Welcome to the Paradigm Kids video class. Can you remember what weather means? Weather is the condition outside at this moment in a specific place. For example, if you see that it's raining outside right now, that is a way to describe today's weather. Rain, snow, wind, sunny days, hurricanes and tornadoes are all weather events. As you can see, the weather can be good or dangerous. Today we are discussing dangerous weather. Some weather can be very dangerous. We are going to discuss some weather situations that can cause damage and even hurt you. We get three types of bad weather. Thunderstorms and lightning, hurricanes and tornadoes. Let's discuss thunderstorms. What is a thunderstorm? It is a storm with thunder and lightning and typically also heavy rain or hail. But what causes a thunderstorm? When moist warm air rises rapidly, a thunderstorm can form. Thunderstorms appear all around our planet every day. Thunderstorms can occur all year and all hours, but they are most likely to happen in the spring and summer months and during the afternoon and evening hours. Do you think thunderstorms are dangerous? Yes, they are. Despite their small size, all thunderstorms can be dangerous. Lightning kills and injures more people each year than hurricanes or tornadoes. Have you ever wondered what causes lightning? Up in the clouds there are all sorts of little bits of rain and snow bouncing around. When those pieces bump into each other, they develop an electric charge, which is just like when you drag your feet across the carpet and get a shock, only way more powerful. Most lightning just shoots around in the cloud and we usually don't even notice it, but every now and then some leaks out and shoots down to the ground. How do we know if lightning is nearby? If you see dark clouds, then lightning could be present. Best thing you can do is to listen for thunder. If you hear thunder, then you know you need to go indoors or get inside a car. Don't be outside where lightning could strike. Can I tell you an interesting fact? You can tell how far away a storm is by counting the number of seconds between when you see the lightning and when you hear the thunder. Take the number of seconds and divide it by 5 and that will tell you how far away the storm is in kilometers. For example, if you count the 10 seconds between the lightning and the thunder, the lightning is 2 kilometers away. How cool is this? In the next lesson, we will discuss hurricanes. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. That's it for today, Paradigm Kids. Please remember to share what you have learned. See you next time.